there, we're in the Phoenix Park Visitor Center and it's a beautiful Halloween out there and um, beautiful autumn with all the beautiful colours and here's a little something maybe you can make on your midterm break and um, maybe give it as a little gift to, to somebody, it's very simple gather up a lot of large leaves, the likes of oak leaves and that really won't work so you'll need something like the maple leaves or sycamore leaves and the more colourful the better and it has been a fantastic autumn with that golden colour. So what you do is you get your leaf and you trim the stalk. So you have the beautiful leaf here, trim the stalk straight across and then you fold it in half, the coloured side outside and you start to wind them. So you wind them like this, really tight, just like the centre of a rose and you keep working it and holding on to it. They're fairly flexible at this stage. Make sure that you get leaves that are, have just fallen, not something that has fallen for a few hours that has gone hard and crispy. That really won't work. So you just keep adding. You see it there? Just keep adding to it. Take your time. Enjoy the process. And again, just hold on to it. Or you can have them all trimmed, ready to go from the beginning. Now you can make it as small or as large as you wish. Take your time and do it slowly. Enjoy the moment. And when you have it about this size, or you could even go twice the size of that, whatever suits, um, you will hold on to it fairly tightly. Now, we don't want to use a glue gun. We don't want to use sellotape, anything like this, because this is a natural product and when we're finished with it, we want it to, to go back to the earth as it came from and it will feed the plants and of course it will feed the insects. When you have it about this size, when you think you have it large enough, then get an elastic band. Now, when this it has rotted down, perhaps you leave it out in the garden when it's finished. Keep an eye out for the elastic band and you can put it in the bin. Don't allow that to go into the garden because, of course, it's not organic. So you just wrap it around like that. Now, you might leave, need a little bit of help um, if you have little fingers. You've left with something that looks like a big cigar. I'm sure most of you don't know what a cigar is, or at least I hope you don't. So what we do here now is we have these gorgeous leaves. So now we can pick the prize of the crop and we can thread them in to the elastic band. Again, you might need a little bit of help with this one. So we'll pop them in, we get gorgeous colours. You see, this one hasn't completely lost all its colour and it still has some of the beautiful green. You'll get greens, you'll get reds, you'll get rust colours, um, all the, the different colours of autumn. And we've been very lucky this autumn. The frost hasn't hit too soon, so we have these magnificent colours all around us. So now we're starting to build up the outside of this little bundle. And really what we're also doing is covering up the outside, the rough outside, if you like. So we're making a little bouquet. You see, it's starting to take shape there. So this is the idea, you see? And we just trim a little leaves like that. We can make it as big as we like, even bigger than that or smaller than that. And it's all come from nature. And it's just nature's waste in a sense and we've made something from it. So come along to the Phoenix Park. Maybe you can um, gather some nice leaves and um, make something pretty and put in some time on your, your midterm break. Take care, have a happy Halloween.